Harper, by a little cider mill. And poor old dog lay down to rest, for he were feeling ill. He chose a most precarious perch above the apple press. And in his sleep he tumbled in and perished in distress. Which caused his master full to grieve, likewise his mistress too. Until their sorrows to relieve, they sampled of the brew. My word, cried Farmer Atwater, the like I ne'er did sup. Come summon in the neighbours and we'll bid them take a cup. Now every man that drank that night got That's drunk as drunk, drunk could be. be. Hey, and wondered how the cider had acquired yeah, such potency. The farmer kept his counsel as he took another drop. When all at once the poor old dog came floating <laughs> to the top. Now a silence fell upon the room and oh, every man, man did frown. Yeah. They recognised old Bendigo, though he were upside down. The squire, he lost his colour and collapsed upon the floor. And the vicar lost his breeches in the rush to reach the door. Hold hard, cried Farmer Atwater, for in all my life I vow. He never bit nor man nor beast and he'll not bite no one now. And this shall be his epitaph, there now is poor faithful Ben. What perished in the scrumpy vat, but quickly rose again. So if you're up to Devon and you goes into a bar, ask for a dead dog scrumpy, it's the best there is by far. Refuse all invitations and you'll sleep just like a log. You can always recognise it by the hair of the dog.